and guys, welcome to another adventure to that. So I'm over here because I wanted to see what this area is all about. I came here and like walked around the whole area and found out this might be the entrance to the chasm. Uh, I mean, <laughs> another entrance to the chasm, of course, yeah, right, uh, <laughs> what am I doing? I mean, another entrance to Sumuru. But for me, even though the theory has been claimed by Paimon herself since I got, like, um, where is it again? The seed from this area, and there's also a dendro slime over here, um, I don't know if this will be the cat, like, the Sumuru City's entrance or anywhere in Sumuru's entrance. It just highly likely will be so, but if it is, I don't know. But anyways, here's just a small clip of, well, me passing this area because there's like a small story over here. Alright, you can do it now. protect you Also, I cleared the Muddy Bizarre Adventure too, so I'll put that a little bit later. Just two clips that I pre-recorded, straight back to back. It's kind of weird, but yeah, small capping for this area. 
But right now, we have several things to do in this adventure. Um, first of all, let's go to Enconomia because I found another quest over here that we haven't actually done. And a multiple stuff on the upper layers of Tavat. Like, for example, these guys over here, which is supposed to be connected to the Dragon Spine bottle. Bottle messes thingies. Oh, and by the way, I cleared like the ultra like um, tag because I got the precious chest out of him. No, I did not get Ultra's chest. I mean, I got his. Well, you, you get the idea. Anyways, um, oh, there's also this over here, but let's do it one by one. So, just a small disclaimer: if you have heard, if you listen to me from the start of the episode to over here. This might be a very, very long recording. So stay tuned. I will make sure it won't get that long, but if it... Well, if it's too long by my editor... He's just right over there. He's just looking at me playing... Uh, well, not playing, using the bean as a puppet to let us explore the area and stuff. Um, yeah, I'll put it on to him. Is that okay? Alright. <laughs> um, why am I... Why am I using this? <laughs> Don't I have like a faster and more safer way to enter it? And this is absolutely not why it's supposed to go. What am I doing? <laughs> cut, cut, maybe cut that out. Or maybe not. It depends. He's the editor. Oh yeah, and I forgot to take my Lumistone off. My Lumine over here. Um, Gadgets, gadgets, gadgets. Here. Alright, and I need to turn off my camera again because we want to let the meme have a show, not me, right? So, waves, mountains, that, circle, got it.
I haven't fight these guys in a long time. I hope I still have the power or knowledge on how to fight them. So that's what this mushroom thing is called. A dragon ball flower? Oh, I'm stuck by the terrain again. Oof. Well, huh. It kind of does look like a bone. Now I get why it's. Ooh. What it's called. Mm, let's just climb this thing then. Oh, come on, don't follow me.
okay, it's time to do like a small event quest, I guess. Or, well, by the time we wait, it's probably going to be like a day or so. So, <clears throat> sorry. Let's do something else in queue. For example, the Black Serpent Knights. And if I can, I will queue the Muddy Bizarre Adventure quest storyline over here. So, editor, can you do it for me?
All right. Well, we'll just put it here. All right. Now, we have to get the nine, um, what is that orb called again? Horse of the Blue Deaths. Because, well, now that I know where to drop from, and I went on some search because it has been some times I uh, last visited the chasm. Also for the quest, that's why I came here again. Now I know that these, like, mysterious black serpent knights actually dropped them. I just need to defeat them all and get all the nine orbs. Then open the door, that's all. So, fast forward? Question mark? Oh, and by the way, if you guys, like, if the speed up that, well, shortens the video, makes you not e able to read what the Black Serpent Knights are saying, I will put it in a separate episode if I have time to create one. So, don't worry, it will be, this part will still be sped up, but I'll put the lines that they say in another video. Alright, speed up again. And all right, that's all of them. Ugh. Finding them on level 91 is sure harder than the original level that I fought them on. That's for sure. Uh, sadly, my characters can only get to level 90, and my Mora is just not enough for upgrading my skill level to all crowned. And I don't have that many crowns anyways so let's just open the door see the door get some chests and well we'll see what happens please don't let there be any more a reward on the road all right, pretty nice chest. There's even luxurious one. All right, let's see. And abyssal script. Huh? Interesting. All right, at least that's now the orbs of the blue death out of the way. Now, we just have the Inazuma quest stuff to do, so, maybe I'll leave it for another, well, another video, because right now, this is getting pretty long, actually. Uh, let me clear these guys out first. Alright, so in the next episode, I'm going to see like the three drifting bottles that drifted from Inazuma apparently, now that I read the text a little bit further, and also the new like event quest too. And let's see what happened. Also going to wait for that orb in Economia to get born, but anyways, Thank you guys for watching, make sure to leave a like and also leave a comment. And if you kind of do so, make sure to also slap that subscribe button into no existence so we won't have any more troubles with our hard enemies. Again, thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you all next time.